Man, y'all know how I get down. Let's get into it. Uh, cursed souls. There's a lot of cursed, cursed souls out here. I talk about this all the time because I want y'all to enjoy your life, you know, until you, you know, God called you home. A lot of us, man, we afraid to uh, fear. Procrastination will kill you, man. I'm telling you, it, it's a, those those kind of thought processes, mindsets. It's because people never be successful because they fear and they worry about worrying about what other people will say or how they be critiqued and and all that. People always gonna talk shit about you. Yes, let's be blunt about it. They're always gonna ridicule you. I'm talking. I'm, I'm talking to the negative people. They're always gonna say you should. They gonna suggest shit. You shouldn't do this. You should do it this way. But they're not you. They're not you. Only you can be you. You know what I'm saying? So, live out your dreams, man. Y'all walking around here, y'all got a curse on you. Curse of drunkenness. Curse of dope. Curse of nymphomania. Curse of pornography. Curse of debt. Curse of poverty. Curse of frustration. Curse of stress. Curse, curse, curse. You cursed. You got a lot of people cursed on YouTube. Gender war this. Black man ain't shit. Black woman ain't shit this. Curse. Cursed souls. Cursed. Beyond measure. Cursed. Beyond measure. Cursed. It's sad. People people ask about, you know, in the flesh or on here, how you doing? How you doing? You okay? This, that. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm enjoying life. I'm going to keep on enjoying life until the day I die. You got to think about it. God ain't put you here to suffer. So why y'all suffering? Why you suffering? I hear people say this in the streets. I'm suffering, man. It's rough out here, dog. It's rough out here, man. Uh, uh, it's rough out here, brother. The sisters be telling me, it's rough out here, brother. I got to do what I got to do. You know, I got to get out of how I live. Hey. So you got to sell out or sell your body and do all this. Do strange things to get changed. That's desperation. And, and, and that's desperation and weakness. Because you are scared to bring out your true God-given talent. So you go the other way and do desperate things. Do go do desperate things to get a little change and do strange things to get changed. But in a strange <laughs> when it all comes down to it, you're gonna have a lot of stuff that befall you. Because you done it incorrectly. You done it the demonic way. Cursed. Cursed. Possessed. Cursed. Cursed. Possessed. Demon possessed. That's that mental slavery, man. That's the demonic mental slavery. The devil got you, got a padlock on your mind. You're not seeking the most high. You're not trying to live out your God-given talent. You, you letting the devil tell you in your mind how to get it. Get it how you live. Do this, do this. Go rob this dude. Take his car. You know, screw his wife and all kind of bull crap. Vice versa. You know, you got women doing the same thing. Creep, you know, creeping on a uh, 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 supposed to be friends. Husband, trying, you know, fucking with the husband, you know. When she leave to go to work, they go, they creep over, they knock on the door. When a negligee, you can see all, everything. Titties, pussy, and all. Come on, baby. You know you want this. Fat to death and everything. And that dude weak. He gon' he going he going um, yeah. Then he, then now he got, now the curse pass on to him. She's cursed. Because she's a no good, rotten, not even a friend of me. She's an enemy. And, and she feel as though she's entitled to that man, not not her not her friend that's married to that man. That's that's his wife, you know. That's his wife, but she feel like she entitled. Why did she have to get a handsome man? Why did she have to get a man that provide? Why did she? Maybe you need to change the ways you have within yourselves. I'm talking to the one these women out here 
back doing they friends. Yeah, I know uh, a lot of y'all keep talking from a male issue. You know, it's a, it's a, it's another uh, a counterpart, which is the female talking. Female be doing the same shit, dude. They just do it a little slicker, cause they, you know, women are, women are not men. Women women are not men. Men are not women. Okay, so we do things. We tend to do things a lot differently. You know what I'm saying? So that's what be going on. Shit, I know about this, man. I done seen this. Matter of fact, I was living with one of my exes. Shit. When I was younger, in an apartment joint, soon as she go to work, shorty come out the door thick. It's all outdoors, red bone. Had had a negligee on, but it wasn't a see-through. But that ass was poking out the back. Big, thick thighs. What's up? What's up? What's up? How you doing? She was she waited for her to leave. It was probably looking out the window. It's very obvious. Cause he was like next door to her, then she pop out. What's up? What's up? You looking all good? Ah, oh, nah, dog. Nah. Mm-hmm. It's very obvious. I mean, next, that's that's you know, it's just two steps. You in it? You know, it's one of those uh, uh, housing joints. You know, well, you know, you might as well say project joints. You know what I'm saying? It's just two steps. You going? You going to the other apartment? Shit, it's right in the hallway. You, you know, it's right next to me. Boop, just like that. Same floor and all. Yeah. Cursed. Cursed. Cursed woman. Jezebel, you know, Jezebels and Medusas and whatever you want to call it. Just unruly women and trifling. Just like these men out here trifling. Cursed, though. They cursed. They enjoy doing demonic stuff. And see, you got to identify with these people, especially if you're walking in the walk of the Most High, because they're going to try to throw, they, these are the individuals that's going to try to stop your dreams. They know, they see it in you. But you, you got to get wise enough to know they see it in you and know, and know how to, you know, have a cordial conversation without flicking off. You know what they're trying to do. And man, I, I, I enjoy doing it. And conversing with the demon, and then the demon walks away because he know he didn't lost. You so and so, so man, what you on? You what you on? YouTube, man. You need to stop that YouTube stuff. No one ain't listening to you, dog. No one ain't paying you no attention, man. What you trying to do, man? You just trying to get the bag, man. No one ain't gonna listen to you, man. Fuck, man. Fuck YouTube. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are you still making videos? Yeah. Look, I've been on YouTube since 2013. I don't care if I get paid or not. I enjoy doing this. See? I love doing this. How many people love doing this? Let me, let, 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 let me, let me pick you out of the game. The ones that don't love doing this, those are your trolls. Slash content creators. They're always, in, they're always fussing with other and talking about celebrities and, 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 and talking about regular YouTubers and cussing them out and doing this. They don't enjoy what they're doing. They curse. They curse and then they curse content creator. And they create all this hysteria, all this confusion. Not teaching nothing. Not giving, not, not giving these youngers a bright future, a future, you know, everything gloom and doom, everything F this, and I'm, I'm the big YouTuber, this, see, those the ones, they don't like what they doing, I like what I'm doing, I'm doing positive stuff, and I'm not going to go to the grave without sharing my talents, and showing my talents in a positive way, and for the benefit of the people. And this is why I keep doing videos to motivate, to to help people out that's that's living in a dump, to show people what they're going through. This is what the, this is what this video is all about. People walking around here cursed, don't even know it. If you broke, it's something wrong. You can't get a good job, it's something wrong. You, you keep getting into relationships and they break through and they break up, it's something wrong. You always frustrated and stressed. It's something wrong. And you under a motherfucking curse. That's what it is. Break the fucking curse. Or you're going to keep being downtrodden. You're going to keep wanting to run to the liquor store and get drunk, 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 drunk. You're going to keep running. Smoke, 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 smoke. You're going to keep running to the needle man. 
shooting in your veins and all this shit. Then they dropping fentanyl, every damn thing, lacing everything. People dropping dead all over the goddamn place because they can't break the curse naturally. They want to. They 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 trying to break the curse by adding on more uh, substance abuse to the curse, and then they gonna get it. Then they gonna get even better. No, you're not. You won't. You won't make the shit worse. It, it, it might. It might be terminal, meaning your ass gonna drop dead. So yeah, I give y'all a bundle of things, man. Y'all need to wake up on the ones that need to wake up, and to the ones that's walking, keep walking in the truth, keep knocking down, knocking down the doors of success, and keep rolling. And don't let nobody—I mean, nobody—even your family members tell you can't do what you want to, what, what God set you out to do. Don't let no one stop that. If God wants you to do something and you set out to do this, do it. Anything that God tell you to do, do it. Because it's for your own benefit. It's not for, just for your own benefit. It's for your livelihood. It's for your life. Your life depends on it. Because God got a mission for you. And you better complete it. Or get deleted. That's right. That's right. I'm out.